This is uh, Som, uh, Som Prakash, a wealth coach and an investor and really excited about sharing a short video with you. Um, this is about how do you create 15% uh, uh, or more return on investment because I created another video before and people are asking me about how is it possible to have uh, even more than 5% uh, rate of return you know now we are talking about let's I will show you online how you can have if you have money some money I'm talking about an investment only 15 to 18,000 pounds if you have so how can you have uh, a return on investment of more than 15% 15 16 percent okay how is that possible and that is through property okay so let's uh, delve into it uh, let me just uh, share my screen okay now we are talking about um, one uh, property let's say I'm in right move and this is a property um, you know like this there are so many properties uh, in the UK and uh, you can find this is a property which I found as you can see this is a studio flat okay um, in uh, Bradford okay and um, you can see here it was listed on uh, since April it has been listed on the market and it was 40,000 before now uh, recently it was it has been reduced to 15,000 pounds now this property is a small studio uh, flat but you can buy it for 15,000 pounds okay now you see that okay reduced uh, to 15,000 pounds you can you can buy it and uh, since 4th of April it is um, they are in the market and wonderful property uh, that means uh, you know this is um, in the Bradford city center itself location is is the city center and uh, you see here you know nothing to be done on this property it is uh, already let out okay if you see the uh, you know the quality of uh, you know this um, room okay this is a studio small one uh, but you see you know everything already well furnished and already been let out and uh, this is right in the city center okay now now this is the investment of 15,000 pounds okay now let's talk about the return okay what you'll be getting now this property has been let out that means this is there is already a tenant in that house and that tenant is paying 300 pound I called this estate agent and find out it is close to the university near city center fantastic property okay now what is the rental income we can expect because it's already rented out 300 pounds this is getting but let's go and do our research for example you know this tenant goes out and somebody else comes in what is the expectation okay this is bd1 postcode I go and search in the same right move bd1 I know uh, in the rental section a uh, studio okay how much a studio can get me on that and uh, uh, in that postcode as you can see here 400 pounds okay now this is not as well furnished probably there is some furniture in there but not the you know white goods they don't have the white goods I don't see any white goods there uh, as the property in here you can see there is fridge there is kettle there is toaster everything they are giving it to us with this property okay now identical property you can see 325 400 pounds you know other properties are 350 310 now very conservative figure as it is let let out for 300 pounds what I will do is I will take a figure of not high-end bare not even 310 I will put in this calculation here I have done a quick calculation just to show you um, this is let's say 300 pound we'll talk about uh, calculate the gross yield and this return on investment that will blow your mind off now you see the gross yield okay how you calculate if you don't know uh, annual rental income is uh, 300 pounds uh, you know again the minimum uh, at lower end I have gone in it could go up to 400 pounds as you can see 450 as well but 300 pounds 12 months 3600 okay now purchase price how much uh, it is uh, they offered for 15,000 pounds so the yield the gross yield is a 24 percent that is huge okay now let's talk about return on investment okay if you don't know what is the return on investment is how much of return how much of the net sort of profit what you'll be getting out of our money invested okay money went in okay unlike the purchase price here so 
Now in this case, we are ex uh, assuming that there is no loan. So that means we have the cash 15,000 pounds we are going to invest in and any other expenditure associated with it, which you will be seeing here. Okay. Now annual rental profit um, divided by the cash put in, okay, the um, amount what you are going to put in there and times 100. Okay. And now in this simple calculation, we have, uh, you know, rent for uh, 12 months, 300 uh, um, pounds per month. So 3,600 pounds and less ground rent, okay, on this property, the ground rent is 300 pounds uh, per annum. So that has been deducted here and maintenance. I'm assuming that I'm not maintaining the property myself. I am letting it, uh, so I am letting um, my letting agent to take care of the, you know, tenancy and uh, maintaining of those. Um, sort of, you know, collecting the rent and giving it to me. I don't want to get in the hassles. Anything wrong goes uh, and, and it happens, uh, you know, in maintenance aspect of it, you know, they will fix it and I will pay the maintenance. So that means maintenance and void. Um, I have put, um, you know, 10% for that, um, you know, allocated 10% for it and 10% for, uh, you know, um, the, uh, you know, maintenance agreement, you know, that that is the, with, with the tenant, 10%, somebody to manage the property, okay. So, the net, after giving out, uh, you know, after allocating 20% of my rental income to, uh, you know, for these, now 2,580 is the net okay net rental profit i'll be getting and out of that no no that is that is net so that means i put in here annual rental profit is uh, 2580 and then how much i am going to put in how much of money is being um you know invested there okay purchase price is 15000 and now there is a stamp duty now stamp duty uh, on the this will be around 450 pounds again it is calculated on the government portal so 450 pounds and then I am allocating around 1500 pound. It will be around well, 800, 900 pounds to around 1500 pounds. So I have given 1500 pounds as conveyancing and legal charges. So 16,950 is uh, the cash I put in. Rental profit is 2,580 net after uh, you know provisioning every other stuff. So now you can see a rental. Um, you know that means the return on investment of 15 percent 15.22 percent what i can accomplish only through these investments simple short investment not making any money in my bank i can get that uh, property um, buy that property and it will give me an yield give me an income of 15.2 percent and all, not only that it will also gain uh, in terms of the capital appreciation because this is a you know, really good property now guys what do you think is this possible 15 percent rate on investment you know return on investment absolutely so um i would highly encourage uh, you know let's uh, find these properties there are so many properties like this uh, all around uh, the uk and look for these properties and gain the most out of your money what you have let the money work for you let that income be passive and become uh, let that income make you financially free with that i am done until the next video over and out